Inshallah, one, before I get started, as always, I would love to say, call out Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh, Shai, by Hashem, we call with Austin, one, three, and the Pops of Great Millstone, so I want to feel that, Inshallah, one. You know, I just want to make a quick lesson, because I was watching this video on YouTube, and I'm going to definitely put the link in the description, because I, I was just mad looking at it, you know, the welfare system and all that, and why and all these single mothers exist, you know what I'm saying, and the man, he's in and out the court system, and it, 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 it it's really, man, we got to get the hell out of Babylon, man. We, we need a Howard Shai now. And on top of that, our people is full of the fury of the Lord, which is the curses. And Jacob's trouble ain't even here. The feminine of the word, that's going to come very soon. Man, it, it, I say, but let me, uh, let me get this first scripture. All right, that's, uh, and I want to play this video real quick, too. All right, but 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 let me read this. Second Corinthians chapter two, uh, verse eleven in the GWT. It says, "I don't want Satan to outwit us. After all, we are not ignorant about Satan's scheming." When you look at that word "scheming" in Google, it means what guileful, crafty, cunning, tricky, slick. I right? and this devil. The reason why the Israelite family structure is so messed up today is because of him. He saw even the so-called white man, the so-called uh, white race, which Caucasian means cave dweller, cave man, cave woman. All right, hey, 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 man, this, this, this devil literally messed our people up so bad. But let me play this video. Hold on. I just want to play this one part. I will, hopefully you can hear it. If not, I will put the link in the description. I was like, damn, here you go. So the state turns your child into a burden. And since many states treat incarceration as voluntary unemployment, child support debts continue accumulating while men are locked away in jail, working for the state for about $1 a day, while the jail collects thousands for his stay, giving the mother none of it. It's easy. Well, anyway, he said that what? Esau got it the way that what he would use your child as a burden. You know what I'm saying? Even though the scripture says to be fruitful and multiply, now your ass scared to have children. I had I had I had multiple women tell me they say, Man, whatever you do, just be careful. Because if you get the wrong she say, they all say the same thing. If you get the wrong woman pregnant, she will put you on child support. Every last one of them said that. Alright? And see, this this shit is by design. It's 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 set up. Even if the man want to be in the in the son or daughter life, he can't even do that. What what kind of setup is we in? Because of uh, 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 Adam, Salaki, because of Edom and Eve. All right. So I'm gonna prove that point. Then I want to um speak on something else. This book of First Timothy chapter two verse fourteen. It says. And Adam was not deceived. Yeah, because Adam was not deceived. Adam wasn't with all that weird shit. All right? You can't get to the man, but you can get to the woman. All right? Because when you take the man out of the household, now you can easily feminize the sons and make the woman masculine. Why? Because the, the little girls, the daughters, see, they mother is what? Being single, so now they believe now they believe that they can do it, etc. Alright? Even that movie, uh Um Don't Be a Menace, that comedy movie, at least it had a, a true statement to it that uh what a, a, a woman can't raise a man. Cause he gonna have some feminine to him, very emotional, and if he can't get his way, what he gonna do, flip. Flip out, throw a tantrum, throw a nigga tantrum. That's why you need a father and a mother. All right, but let me finish reading this off. First Timothy chapter two, verse fourteen. It says, "And Adam, and Adam was not deceived, but the woman, being deceived, was in the transgression. It was in the transgression. All right, because what she weak of vessel. And see, women love power. Whoever in power, that's what they gonna flock to." All right, but the man he gonna fight to the death. Now you got dudes, lock, just like one dude I seen in there, and I was 
Lock up for that little bit of time S Somebody I know I said oh that's where your ass been at The one I ain't seen you outside I asked him hey man Why you lock up for he said child support said, Damn Hell you been just not working Yeah but you know shit happens Now I'm saying And I actually see this dude with his kids But hey The system is fucked up Another situation where a dude Was with his daughter and the mother didn't like that. You know what I'm saying? And the dude was like, well, damn, I can't spend time with my daughter. This, 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 my daughter. The police came and took his daughter from him. The dude, like, he about to cry, you know, break down the, well, now I ain't gonna say break down the tissue. Well, I don't know. But the dude, you know, like, he about to start damn crying. You know what I'm saying? Because he can't even take care of, he, he can't spend time with his own child. That damn, uh, 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 Eve and that damn serpent Mr. Damn Devil Alright In another story where a dude keeps saying um, He was with his woman She left him for somebody else And put him on child support And he was in and out of the court system So much to the point that When the judge seen him One time the judge was like oh, Why y'all won't leave this man alone Even if the damn judge, from what the dude said, he said that what the judge said, say, why y'all won't leave this man alone? The woman keep bringing him to court. That's that's messed up. See, see that's why so many single mothers and, and these little monsters running around got no care in the world. They ain't got no discipline. Let me read this again. I'm in the second Corinthians chapter 2 verse 11 in the, GN, in the GWT. It says, I don't want Satan to out with us after all we are not ignorant about satan's scheming see this devil he come up to you like he's helping you but no this devil don't want to help you he want to uh, uh 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 make you to drink of that poison that he stirred this man is a witch he's the devil all right that ain't real food you eat that shit full of poisons chemicals all right Fluoride, fluorine, whatever the hell in it, man. That's why we gotta get the hell up out of here. We need Yahweh Shai now. You see? So again, I tell this video slash lesson. Hey, Amen. Serpent and Eve, you know, something like that. Alright, that or eat them and Eve. But yeah, like I say, I will put the video in the description. You gotta check it out, man. Hey, Amen. The whole video go hard. I'm going to go ahead and end this uh, lesson off by saying, Call all you have a Hashem, I'm sorry, by Hashem, we call Kodas, the Bonsu, the Apostle, the Great Millstone, and shout out to the whole field, let shout out amen, and to the brothers that's enduring that that baby mama struggle, that shout support shit, man. Hey, keep on fighting, that's all I can say, because I ain't want that smoke. I ain't want that smoke. That's, that's man, that's so dangerous. Damn, I feel bad for y'all, brothers, man. That shit. Hey, Shalom, man. Damn.